Hey, what's up, guys? This is Gabriel Carneiro here. So let's keep going. And now we're going to use the PyTest testing the exception, right? And just to remember, we are testing this, this product uh, uh, class here as we did in unit test. This time we're using the PyTest. And we didn't test yet this, these two uh, validators, these two methods. They are just checking if the number is positive in this case here. It, it would not accept a negative number. And it, this one is checking if this talk is negative. So um, let's, let's just go ahead and test these methods. So let's type here, test, check, positive number. And just to, again, remember, we need to use, we needed to use a fixture in this, uh, this file here. So we are creating a, a, a product instance uh, with ID one name test value one and stock 10, 10 items, right? So we need to pass a uh, product as an argument here. So we have access to it. So now we have to use the with block, uh, calling pi test raises, and then passing exception that we're expecting to happen here. So we can use a name as a cert error. Then let's just go ahead and call product. Uh, check positive number. Now I will, I will create the exception by passing a negative number. Okay. So let's just test it. Let's assert um, and call assert error look to value in the argument in the position zero args sorry the position zero so that should be equal to uh the name the message we have here in the, in the method so number must be positive right so let's paste it here and then let's run python dash m i test in the name of the file so we have everything okay here our test just passed. Okay, so if somebody messed up in the future and removed something and then test again, it should break, right? Because uh, they are different. Uh, the, these two assertions are different. Okay, so let's fix it and, and try again. The pass, the, 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 the test is, is just fine. And now let's test in the another, another method. So we are testing check positive stock again we have to pass product to have access to the instance and then go again with with block so pi test raises exception as cert error so product in this case i'm going to do um, a little bit different um because I need, uh, I'm using this this uh, uh, exception here side of the decrease stock. So I will pass decrease stock, causing the 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 stock to become negative. I'm gonna do it. So now our instance has ten items in the stock, right? So if I just pass decrease stock and then pass eleven. It should drop um, the stock to uh, to become negative, so it's going to become negative and um, decrease, right? And then let's run the assert again. So assert error value argument in the position zero should be equal to the message here. Stock must be greater then or equal to zero, right? So I'll copy this and I'll paste here. Now we'll run again. All right, so our, our test passed just, uh, just fine. So again, we need to use with lock and we can capture the exception in here. So we do not break the test, uh, executing a, like raising the exception in the middle of the test. And then we cannot go and move further. So in this case, we're, holding the information here, the exception here, the message inside of the uh, assert error, 
value so we can have access to it uh, going to the argument in the position zero so then uh, we can test our uh, exceptions just fine so uh, see you in the next video